Hey y'all, welcome back to the Roadhouse. Um, today we're gonna do a little bit of everything, y'all. We got some, uh, I'm gonna make some homemade jalapeno poppers. And uh, all I did with that, I browned about a half pound of ground meat and put uh, one little eight ounce package of uh, cream cheese in there, seasoned up my meat. We got some boneless uh, pork ribs, I call them pork fingers. I'm gonna throw them on there, and I got some chicken legs and some chicken thighs. And I'll probably do some bread and stuff too. But uh, get out here and get the grill going, gang. I'll meet y'all outside. All right, gang. Y'all welcome back. We got the, uh, the pork ribs, pork fingers. I call them. Put on there. We got our poppers in there. This is my new grill grate. I know I did this once before. But, uh, man, this thing is fantastic for putting poppers and got different size holes for big ones and little ones, whatever kind of junk you want to put in there. A little basket for vegetables and stuff. I just put some uh, Dickies, another local uh, place here in New Orleans. Uh, Dickies Polish sausage is really good. Now, I hit these pork fingers with a little bit of my the, uh, the Fiesta pork rub. Uh, there again, uh, the uh, jalapeno poppers I took in... Uh, brown down about a half a pound of some ground chuck season it up with some you know spg uh wrapped them in bacon i, I did put a little cheddar cheese in there a philadelphia cream cheese mixed all that with the ground meat and i uh, just piped it into the peppers there but uh got this going gang we're gonna let this roll a little bit and get done it smells really good we got the old joe bronco at about 325 She's going, folks. Look at that. And then, for my chicken, I hit that with some chicken rub. Yeah, it's the chicken rub. I had to fire up the old Weber here. <laughs> That's my go-to, though. Had to show the Weber a little love today, y'all. So, uh, when it gets done, ready to throw the chicken on, we'll be back. All right, the Weber's hot. We got the chicken legs and chicken thighs on this bad boy. Just added some pecan wood chunk to it. We're going to let it roll a little bit and... We'll check back in probably about 15 minutes, y'all. Isn't that a pretty sight, y'all? Going Bronco and old Weber going to town. Yeah, buddy. Back in a little bit, y'all. All right, we've been going about, oh, 15 minutes or so. We're going to turn this chicken over. Let the other side get happy. I need little, little chicken thighs. Don't take long to cook, y'all. Legs take a little bit longer. All right. Reset my timer. We'll be back. Alright, we got a chicken flip. Let's uh, check the pork fingers and the poppers. Oh man, of course, we ain't gonna flip the poppers, all our junk will fall off. <laughs> but we can flip our pork fingers and our sausage there. Grab there some tongs. Oh yeah, baby. Tell y'all what, man, I am just tickled to death with this Bronco. I'm glad I bought this thing. Oh, yeah. Look at that, man. Everything looks so good. Mmm, gosh, it smells so good, y'all. Okay. We set a timer on this one, and uh, we'll be back, y'all. All right, y'all. Attempt our chicken thighs. We're going to pull them bad boys. We're about 168 to 170 on these. We're gonna get all these off of here. Well, wow, they're still nice and juicy. My legs got a little bit. Oh, did y'all see that? <laughs> yeah, baby. Now take that, sucker. <laughs> nice and juicy, y'all. Nice and juicy. Alright. Legs have a little bit more to go. They're about 163. So, they're getting there. Uh, 
back in a few. <laughs> All right, y'all. Welcome back, y'all. Just tempt our pork fingers. Maybe about 150, which is a little more than I like. Remember, it's in there multitasking. Be all right. We'll pull them before they dry out. Well, it's 150 ain't too bad. And that sauce is done, yeah. Look at that. Mmm. 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 Oh, yeah. Get all that, all that juice, man. Hell, yeah. And all our little poppers are done. See me them pretties? Yeah. Oh, it smells so good out here. Oh, yeah. mm -hmm. All right, let me get the rest of these pulled off, guys. And I'll meet y'all inside. All right. Let's check these chicken legs, y'all. See if they if they up your temps. Anyway, they done, y'all. Pull them about 165. I like to pull mine about 170 or something like that. So we're a little over that, but that's okay. Because you know why? I know it's cooked. All right, I'll meet y'all inside again. All right, y'all. Welcome back. We got everything pulled off. That's your pork fingers, your poppers, your sausage, chicken thighs and chicken legs. And Miss Carrie made some baked beans, some spinach. And we did some, uh, uh, what you call that, some uh, stovetop stuffing. Love that stuff, man. Anyway, we'll plate up here in a minute, gang. All right, y'all, we plated it up. Everything looks good, smells good. Sample the chicken, that's a little spicy with that chicken rub. Let's have a little red pepper on something. Yeah, get more on some. That's our kind of pina popper there. Some of our sausage, baked beans, stove top stuffing, spinach, chicken thigh, back to the chicken leg. Oh yeah. Alright gang, let's cut some of this junk up and see how it did. Alright, put the camera back on here. I'll bear with me. I'm going to zoom up on this and see what we got. Oh yeah. Usually you being bad on video, yeah. Let's we'll see about this. Oh yeah. That's our pork finger. That's still juicy. Now I had that with the pork rub that he has to season. Pretty good stuff, y'all. Mm-hmm. Very good. Back out here. I'm gonna grab some of that chicken leg and see how we did on that. <laughs> chicken legs are pretty good, y'all. If I do say so myself. Come on, camera boy, get it straight. Good stuff. Mm hmm. Mm. That's good. No. That is done. Still smoking, champ. Oh, that does have a little kick to it. Good gracious. Let's check out the chicken thigh. You know, that was still real juicy and stuff. Aww. Oh, yeah. Chicken thighs. 
you see? Mmm. Yeah, that's good. I will say again, I like the, uh, the Fiesta brand rubs. They're really good. Now, you just kind of, you know, pick and choose, kind of experiment with them. The chicken rub, it's got a good flavor, but boy, it's, it's got some spice to it. So if you like it like spicy, that's the one you want to use. Anyway, we're going to get out of here, y'all, finish eating dinner. Uh, thank y'all for watching and subbing and commenting. I really appreciate it. And, uh, so we try to upload here every Saturday. Holidays, hope everybody had a wonderful holiday season. I know we did. Uh, we're going to get our belly full and we out of here. And we'll see y'all next week. Bye-bye. You know,